Right. So now we're going to final this, this idle stew. It should be coming down nicely now. Remember, every stir you stir, you're making the food sweeter. Yes? That's the idea. You can see your peas. And now for the sake of time, you really need it to come down, not so much water. You need it to come down until it starts to thicken a bit. Yeah? So we're going to put in all our string beans. Yes. Then we're going to put in the carrots that are cut in the julian style. First, we have the others. This is the final in of the pot now. Yes. Then we're going to add the rest of seasoning. Yes. That's onions, purple and white onions. Then your tomatoes and sweet peppers. And your spring onions, scallions. Then, of course, we're going to put in our ginger as well. Then we're going to put in our turmeric. And you can always get these from us as well. Those who want to try, if you have healthy salts and you want to try it, this is a good time too. Then we put in some more thyme. We use thyme every time for everything, yes? Oh man, the flavors are so beautiful. And the colors, the red, the gold, and the green, Rastafari always try to cook with those colors or any other colors. And now the flavors are all coming out. So as what Nereri was explaining, it is when this is finished, we add like our spicy coconut, depending on what you want, to get an extra coconutty flavor. You would add this to it when the meal is finished. You know, you could also add your spicy noni, yes, when the meal is finished. Everything when the meal is finished, you put in, and you will just allow that to sit for a little bit until it's cool, and then you share. And that's how we actually make Ital stew. <laughs> One of my favorite food. Yes, I. Yeah. So because I want to get it, the texture a little bit thicker, I'm going to leave the pot open so it evaporates and dry out. Yes, that's my first lesson in teaching the internet world about how to make Ital stew. I thank you for being my partners in this process. And yes, we really hope you learned. And if there's any question you'd love to ask, this is a good time for you to ask right now. Okay. Yes, to answer how do you know when it's ready? Uh, the, hardest, the hardest thing to cook would normally be the corn. Yes? So come on, look a bit more. So you check the corn, yes? Yes, so this needs to go down a little bit more. So, so you know by checking. <laughs> yeah. All right, so you have to test the food, okay? And the texture is normally, it's not a paste, but it should not be loose, yeah? It should just come down until it is all sort of tied together.
If you have too much water, you have to allow it to evaporate. I, I would like to ask a question. Please, go ahead. Okay, I, I think you guys, um, in, in, you're from Mexico? Yes, yes, yes. I think you guys are very hot, but what's your spiciest pepper you have? Because ours, our pepper can actually change your complexion. Like if you eat it, I can tell you, you will turn like you're sunburned. So, <laughs> what, what's, what pepper do you have that actually do that? The jalapenos. The jalapenos. I know that one. It's very hot. So you would want to you you would want to use that, but you don't want to use you want to throw the whole pepper in, but you don't want to basically break it. You just want the flavor of the pepper. So you don't want it too spicy. Yeah? Yes, so you just You throw the pepper in to get that flavor in. If it bursts, you can burst it once and just sort of shake it around but take it out quickly so it's not super super spicy but if you're mexican you should love spice yeah we're spicy people okay great yeah thank you so much no problem look in the pot yeah and as we say stir it makes it more beautiful yes Somebody asked about the twigs that went in. It's, it's time. Time. We use time every time. Yeah? Always time for time. So as, Rastaf as Rastafari, we see life as cooking. Everything in the pot is a different race. <laughs> a different people yes different environment and we all bring them together to make a beautiful planet and that's the idea any other questions can you, can you say again the name of the food science the Rastafari food science ital the ital the name of yes it comes from either the word natural or vital yes so ital is about everything that is natural. It's a natural vibration. Thank you. You are welcome. We're going to, as the pot signs up, we're going to walk you closer to our, where some family members of us are doing some drumming. Yes? And I see you again right here. Family from overseas, it was a pleasure. Thank you for being at our first. I tell cooking presentation, our journey has really been a very long one. We never saw ourselves to be doing things like these. Your internet connection is unstable. However, we are here doing this because we know that the internet needs healing. We know that it, is, it cannot just be about things that does not support or sustain life. Yes, and it is a tool that can connect us in a time when we need to be distance apart. I felt like I was close to you. Um, today we have our program, we call it Intimate Irits, and I felt a very intimate vibration. And just thank you all for sharing, for being here. And we just hope to, when we have our next class, you will join us. Different classes, how to bake, things like cornmeal pudding. Beverages. Beverages. Um, the drum. Uh, making the drum from the drum from making the history of the drum to playing to so different um, a drum circle class with different playing and we're going to just walk you down to one of the drum, drum circle right now so you can just go with the rare and then you come back in a moment